if I'm honest with you, I think the, the need or the desire for me to create, it comes probably from a, 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 at heart, a younger, a much younger version of myself. You just kind of build this burning kind of like feeling in your heart of, of wanting to talk about things that you feel aren't being said or that elephant in the room isn't being considered. For me, it's always whenever it comes to a project or a new work, it's really thinking about the things that aren't being said or that should be said, that could be said, need to be. This process was a long time coming. Um, you know, I was approached by Fiona Parry, a uh, senior curator at, at, at Turner Contemporary, you know, back in 2008, it's four years ago. Obviously, when we think about the other pandemic that extended the amount of time. In some ways, I'm actually kind of grateful for that because I think that additional time allowed me to really have genuine conversations around ideas, ideas around, you know, um, placement, um, migration, class, um, issues that really affect, you know, the, 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 the UK. But I think, like I said, at the heart of it is really just having the time to do that. I've never tramped Britain. but lost it all the same. At the heart of, uh, of the film Wayfinder, uh, we, it, it, it's centered very much around a, uh, a young black girl um, by the name of The Wanderer. Essentially, The Wanderer is, uh, is, is on a journey uh, across England. Uh, there are a range of characters that our Wayfinder comes across, uh, in particularly at the beginning, a, a griot. And uh, a griot, particularly known within um, Western African culture, and when I think about my own Ghanaian Akan heritage, a griot essentially is somebody who holds stories in relation to the times and tells those stories through a range of approaches, whether that's through song, through prose, literature, uh, and, and various approaches to art. Come riddle me, riddle me, mother, he said. Come riddle it all to me, whether I should have fair Elena or bring the brown girl home. You're hearing a range of aspects of prose or, or, or even um, monologues that relate to journeying, that could be relating directly to the wonder. Again, I'm leaving this up to the viewer, but um, these sets of uh, conversations, if you will, bring up ideas that relate to history, ideas that relate to uh, traveling, ideas that relate to um, the experience of being othered or that of uh, migrants, um, and even down to that of gentrification. Within one of the, the, the spaces for the solo show, we have uh, dedicated almost entirely to, you know, the Relic Traveller project, which has uh, existed since 2017. Uh, so, you know, five years this year. You know, it really started out uh, with, a, with a set of ideas, uh, thinking a lot on, on a local level about uh, the, the Brexit vote, uh, which took place, of course, in the UK in 2016, which I would argue really kind of affected the, 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 the approach to nationalism that the rest of the, the West kind of, kind of like opened up from there, you know. For me, um, as far as I'm concerned, a place that closes its borders isn't simply just closing um, the door to people, but it's closing uh, the door to, um, to culture. Because then over time, should that continue, said place, it becomes a relic. Thank you.
in planning the uh, the uh, the gaming environment with with Dee and Toby, um, you know, the, the the idea was really to to create a, a communal environment that people are able to create some of their own links, hopefully, toward uh, a phenomena that has been so deeply important to my work. It's been so deeply important to my practice. In some ways, and you know, you could say in the early 2000s, in fact, it was actually frowned upon. You know, it's quite interesting how now gaming is something that is quite accepted within the, uh, the echelons of the art scene. I guess I'm trying to bring people into the, the understanding of my mindset, but I'm kind of leaving the keys to the car there for people to kind of drive away and, and, and have, have a good time for themselves.